everybody welcome back to the native family if you are new here welcome don't forget to hit that subscribe button on your way in and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you can be notified when we upload new videos if you're returning hey family what do you think i have here i have an awesome 99 cent store haul for you guys during the summer you guys won't see me doing a lot of 99 cent store hauls because i usually take a vacation from it my girls go to school very close to the 99 and I end up there about five days a week when they are in school because I like to park in the parking lot and wait for traffic to die down because of all of the crazy drop off lines. It's a madhouse by the kids at school. So I usually will go in and poke around to see if I could find anything new, anything I might want to try. And today I hit the jackpot. I was super excited. So I'm going to go ahead and get started and show you what I found. They had these go green set of four cutting mats it's a product contains wheat straw fiber fresh and natural appearance non-slip base to keep mats from slipping dishwasher safe doesn't dull knives and it's a uh, food safe and non-microwavable i hope you wouldn't put it in the microwave but look how awesome this is guys you get four of them and you get it in this really pretty pink this like sea foam green sky blue and this really pretty natural like oatmeal color so I was happy when I found these. I do use different cutting boards for, you know, doing meat, doing vegetables, doing fruit and fish. So I this is good for $3.49. I will definitely go back and get a couple packs because that's something you could find at like Bed Bath and Beyond. And I'm sure it'd be a lot more than $3.49. Um, beauty wise, I did go in there and I found this really pretty luxury essentials lip gloss it's watermelon juice lip gloss and i don't know if my camera is doing it justice but i will give you a close-up they have these beautiful flowers floating in it so i am i'm so excited i i had a friend on instagram tell me that she had picked it up and she loves it um 99 cent store and more um if you follow her, her on instagram she does post a lot of awesome things for the 99 cent store as well so I'm kicking myself in the butt for not getting more. And I, I generally just got it because it was aesthetically pleasing. <laughs> I know that's horrible. But now that she says that it's good, I wish I would have got more. I do have a couple videos coming up for you guys. Um, in the month of September, I'm going to be showing you some treats to make for Halloween. And these Halloween zipper bags are perfect. You get 40 in here. And they're just a little like little snack seal bags. And I will be putting my little tr monster trail mix in here and things like that. This is the only pattern that I found right now. I know there's more out there. So I'm going to pick up a couple more bags because I do like to send the girls um, in their lunch with a little bit of extra treats. Just in case there's somebody sitting next to them or something that may need a lunch that don't have one. That way they can share. So we picked those up for that. I just spent so much money at Hot Topic for buttons for these girls walk into the 99 and they had the cutest buttons and they were five for 99 cents you get the sloth and he's super cute this is nena's pack and then you got the sloth face and this one says hello this one says slow down and the rainbow she's going to love these she really does love the little sloth characters and then for rhiannon i did pick up this one look at her they're so cute i love her little hairband and then you get the little bones and then the little baby one with the little choopy in its mouth. The paw print and this one says pug life. So you get five buttons for 99 cents. Super awesome deal. I know I'm a sucker for journals, but during the winter time, I will do a lot of junk journaling. I will do a lot of drawing. I will pick up a pen and paper and just start drawing when I'm bored. So this was perfect and it's my favorite thing. It has cacti on it. I love the colors of it. I love the pop with the flowers. Um, it doesn't say how many pages are in this. It is a Momentum brand notebook, but I could never have enough notebooks as far as this. I don't like the cheesy ones like you get from like the Dollar Tree all the time. I do like the hard um, spined ones. Okay, the hubby needed some more of the Dove um, body soap. This is the only uh, bar of soap that I will buy for the family. I generally don't even like to buy off-brand of the liquid soap, too. I will buy the Dove um, body wash as well. Um, our dermatologist says this is the best soap for sensitive skin, so that is a, always a repurchase. I have been searching for this. I've been seeing everybody and everybody calling it, and it's the Pond's Perfect Color Complexion Anti-Marks 
for natural color. This is for normal to dry skin. I absolutely love Pond's products. It was something my mother used and my grandmother used. So well-known brand in our family. The hubby needed some new lotion, and we usually buy him the Vaseline lotion anyways. And to find it at the 99, I was super happy because I only had to go to one store. So $2.99, it is a 10 fluid ounce bottle. I'm sure couponing and sales and stuff like that, I could have got like a little bit cheaper. But I told you guys, I've tried to coupon and it just frustrates me. It's something I would love to learn though. So I did pick up the Cocoa Radiant. This is a, a brand and a, how do you say, a brand and the fragrance that we've already used in our house. And it is a well-loved product here. I was searching for this little beautiful girl kitty cat. I wanted the coffee mug. So I did find the spoon rest. She is adorable. They are $2.99. But this is like quality of that what you pay for like $9.99 at Home Goods or you know Michaels or any of those other little stores like that. She is beautiful. And I think the cup is $3.99, but I really, really want the cup. And it should probably stay in my kitchen year round because I do have a lot of red in my kitchen. So I was happy that I at least found the spoon rest. Now, if you guys have been following me for a while, you know I absolutely love Tim Burton. I love Halloween, I love horror stories, I love all of it. So when I saw these two little creatures right here, they are adorable. My best friend got me um, the mummy candy dish, the little mummy kid, and she recently picked me up the jack-o'-lantern kid, so all I need is Frankie now. But I thought these two little creatures right here would look so cute sitting next to them in my coffee bar. So this little guy here has his paw resting on a very happy jack-o'-lantern. He's got his little bone in his mouth and his big eyes. And these just melted my heart. I fell in love with them. And then his buddy has his foot um, resting on a skull. Again, he has his little ears popped up. Super cute. So those will be going in my coffee bar as soon as I start getting it set up. I am going to be doing a video to show you guys. Oh my gosh. And then they had these candles. I don't remember who I saw on Instagram post these. I do apologize. But it's the Wolf Bane number five potion slightly bitter poison to use and take the edge off of and i can't read this lettering it's a little too light on here but i fell in love with these and the black one is identical in the writing and the wording now when you open this one it has a patchouli scent to it to me that's what the kind of notes that i'm picking up um it reminds me of a metaphysical shop i was in when i was a child but it smells really good. It actually smells something that reminds me of my father. And then this one has notes of vanilla and cinnamon in it. I didn't really buy these for the candle. That's a bonus. They are $1.99. $1.99 for this, this is awesome. I am going to burn the candles down, empty these out, and these will be a part of my coffee bar. So those are some awesome additions. I know I'm missing one more. I think there is one with a vampire on the front of it. I'm not sure I have to go back and reference it on Instagram, but I will, once I find it, I will pick it up because they are airtight containers. I can't get the lid off one handed. Let me see if I can get the lid off so I could show you. They are single wick candles. They are the nice um, ceramic on the inside and they do have the little airtight type thing. So you could easily burn these, use these for tea, sugar. You could put little candies in these and then you know the opportunities are endless when it comes to those all right now tea season is coming up i know it's still kind of warm but we do have you know falls coming so i found this isabella honey premium it says it's 100 percent pure all natural no artificial colors direct from the hive no high fructose corn syrup and i want to check the ingredients here um, it doesn't say, nope, so it's supposed to be pure honey, and I do like the jar too, so once I get this all taken off, it'll be a nice addition to my coffee bar, so we picked that up. I did pick up this Day of the Dead keychain for a friend here. Um, Bobby had asked me to see if I could find her one of these, and this was the last one I found, so it was meant to be, so Bobby, I did find you the Day of the Dead keychain that you had requested um i will comment down below and i'll give you my email that way you can send me your address okay then i hit the jackpot on earrings they had just put this out it was a huge line it was on a little pig hook you know how they do that and their earrings they're by femme 
and now these are the really pretty silver earrings and if you can see there's detailing like that these are nice hoops three girls in the house these will definitely go to use I like the little way that they look crisscrossed they did have these um, thicker all silver hoops with no design I really like these ones sometimes I like simplicity and then in silver hoops they also had this one so that's pretty um try to show you all the silver ones then they had this set of earrings which is also a really nice set and then they had gold tones which Rhiannon likes gold tones and then they had these cute little chunky gold hoops and these were all 99 cents, so that's why I was like gung-ho gung -ho and bought like seven pair. Then they have these. And now these ones, the last two pairs are just the gold version of the silver ones that I showed you guys. But I really do like the detailing on this. I have a bracelet that will match this pretty good. And then these are like the silver ones as well. With a little braided chain in the middle. So these earrings are cool. You know, you can do stocking stuffers. Holidays are coming really quick. It usually happens faster than we want it to. So you, if you have teenagers that have friends, you get one of those little makeup bags that are out there right now and a couple pairs of earrings, and you have a perfect gift for a gift exchange for the teenagers. Um, like I said, three girls in the house. All these hoops will go to use. And this is my 99 cent store haul. Um, I don't buy as much as I used to. I used to get all crazy. Now I'm just buying things that I know that we're absolutely going to use. Three girls, seven pairs of earrings. We will definitely wear those no problem. These guys just make my heart smile. And I'm on the lookout for the next candle. Are you guys finding anything cool out there at the 99? If you are, let me know it down in the comments down below if there's anything I should be looking for. If you're new here... Um, and you don't have a 99 cent store. A 99 cent store is, let's see, the closest thing I can explain a 99 cent store would be like if Big Lots and Dollar Tree had a baby. That's the closest thing I could probably tell you. Or maybe if you have a five and below, it'd be like five and below and the Dollar Tree had a baby. Because um, I know that the 99 is not in every state. So if you guys like this kind of video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell to be notified of when we upload new videos. And don't forget, family, be kind, inspire, be inspired, and I will see you next video. Bye.